Hello everybody and welcome back. This is a quick video with two main functions. Firstly, just a very quick catch up on where I've been for the last few months. It's been far too long since I posted my last YouTube video. And secondly, I wanted to say an official thank you for my 1000 subscribers, which I think I reached shortly after I posted my Jane Eyre vlog, which is now really quite a while ago. So that will be part two of the video. Without further ado, let's catch up. I have had a really full, busy, wonderful few months. I got married, that's the main thing that happened. I've also just had loads of big family events, other family weddings, big family birthdays, big friends' birthdays, and this has led to just lots of traveling around the UK, um, even a small amount of international travel, and yeah, it's just been really, really full and really busy in a wonderful way, but also in a way that means that I have rarely stayed in the same place for more than a few days at a time. I haven't had my own things with me for absolutely ages and I've just been completely out of routine. I haven't done very much reading and it hasn't been very easy to make videos and I haven't had very much time for making videos. So I've kind of fallen out of the habit. Um, and I think I then also reached a bit of a point where it felt like a lot to go back into it and I felt like making a video meant that I had to commit to a regular schedule and commit to making, you know, each video being the very best video that I've ever made. So I kind of just want to put this short, quick catch up out here as a way to get myself back into making videos because I love doing it. I really miss doing it. I miss this community and talking with you all about books. And so I thought I'd just post a quick video to get myself back into the habit. And I think a few of the videos I would like to put out coming up over the next few weeks, which is still going to be really, really busy and full. We'll just be shorter videos, some book reviews, maybe some tags, um, bits and pieces that I'd filmed before but haven't edited, things like that, just to enjoy the process of making videos again. The other big and exciting news is that next week my husband and I are moving to London. So we've been living in the Democratic Republic of Congo for the last four years, which is, yeah, really a long time. It's gone so quickly um, for my husband's job and he's now got a new job starting in London, which is really exciting. I've never lived in London before, even though I'm from the UK and I'm so excited for all of the London things that we're going to be able to do there. Most of our friends live in London, so it's gonna be really lovely to be close to them. I am hoping to take up ballet again, which I've really missed. I haven't been able to find a dance school or anything where I can do ballet in the Congo, so although I've occasionally done it at home, I'm just, I'm just not very good at exercising by myself at home, so I'm really looking forward to being able to go to actual classes when I'm in London. I am, of course, looking forward to the theatre and to bookshops and, yeah, just museums, coffee shops supermarkets, <laughs> lots of little things, tap water that you can drink, things that will be a real treat after coming from Congo, as well as all of the things that are really special about London in and of itself. So really, really looking forward to that and to, I guess, a wider range of videos I'm going to be able to make living in London. Moving to London, of course, means that another big thing we've got going on, had going on, is the process of moving, trying to move our stuff across continents is um, fairly time consuming. We're currently in the process of going through the house and selling loads of stuff, giving loads of stuff away, deciding what we want to take with us, trying to work out where things are going to fit in our lovely but comparatively small London apartment. Um, and so yeah, we're just in that process. We've got the packers for the like international shipment coming on Monday, um, so we, I've still got some stuff to do, and then I think we'll get our stuff in kind of a few months time, which is actually weirdly kind of helpful. I think it will give us time to buy some furniture for our new place, which is currently completely unfurnished. Um, and then once we hopefully have some storage, then our things will arrive, all being well. So that's what I've been up to in life. 
Um, regarding my 1000 subscribers, I just wanted to take this opportunity to say such a huge, massive thank you to each and every one of you who has enjoyed my content enough in order to click subscribe. It really means a lot to me. I love making these videos, love talking about books with you and sharing thoughts and reflections and bits of my life on here. It's something I've enjoyed honestly a lot more than I would have thought that I would enjoy it. Um, and I'm so excited to get back into it. I have genuinely really missed it, even though I've been really happy and really busy in my life. This is something that I guess feels like a small part of my identity now. And when I'm not doing it, I definitely felt the lack of it. So yeah, thank you for making that possible and being so encouraging and lovely. I've met some fantastic people through here, had some wonderful book recommendations and yeah, just kind of without exception loved every moment of it. In celebration of reaching a thousand subscribers, I have been meaning for ages to release my blog that I've been quietly working on in the background. And I think a little bit like feeling like I can't get posting videos until everything is perfectly ready. I have felt like I couldn't share this blog until it was perfectly ready. And I'm trying to just break that perfectionism a little bit and put things out there, even though they might not be in the absolute very best ideal version of themselves, which I imagine that they could be in. So my blog has been part of a resolution that I've had for a long time to do more writing. Um, I love writing as many readers do. And even though I journal a lot, I feel like it's a very different form of writing to write a review or even just a small reflective piece. It's something that I kind of just want to hold myself accountable to doing more frequently because I really, really enjoy it. So I've been trying for a long time to write a proper book review of the books that I read as well as obviously talking about them on here. Um, I haven't written a book review for every single book that I've read, but I've written a fair number and I've gathered them together on the blog. So I will leave a link in the description box below. Please do check it out if you would be interested in reading some of my book reviews. I have future ideas for the blog, but I think at this point, I've kind of been working on this for probably like a year and I don't actually think it's changed very much over the course of the year. I've just kept thinking it's not ready to share. And so, um, yeah, here it is. I was always planning to share it when I reached a thousand subscribers and now I have, so here it is. And I'm hoping to add to it over the upcoming weeks, maybe fill in some old gaps of reviews that I haven't written yet, but also contribute some new content. So yeah, I hope that you enjoy and an enormous thank you to each and every one of you who watches these videos. That's all for today. I hope you're doing really well. Do let me know down in the comments what you've been up to over these past few months. If there's anything good that you've read that you would like to recommend to me, I always love hearing your book recommendations. Take care of yourselves and I look forward to seeing you hopefully soon in another video. Bye bye.